HBO. Next on the Sunday Night Movie, kick in the afterburners. An Air Force brat and a veteran pilot steal two jets for a daring rescue mission in Iron Eagle, starring Louis Gossett Jr. Next. When it comes to originals and specials, HBO's New Year's resolution is make it hot and make it live. Are you ready for me? HBO World Stage creates a carnival for the sizzling Tina Turner, live from Rio. Cable TV's best and brightest sparkle right here as Elaine Boozler and John LaRoquette host the ninth annual Ace Awards Live. It's the Emmys and the Oscars and the Golden Globes all rolled in one. HBO Comedy Hour Live presents Robert Klein, headlining an all-star toast to the improv with guest graduates Robin Williams, Billy Crystal, and Richard Lewis. Mike Tyson is live and dangerous in his second unified title defense against former champion Larry Holmes. Glide from the brutal to the beautiful as the cream of the world figure skating crop salute Dorothy Hamill. Our original series continue as the Not Necessarily the News crew asks, What kind of a year was 1987? No institution is sacred in Not Necessarily the Year in Review. Now then, HBO's own California Bulls are hell-bent and playoff-bound. Yes. Oh, yes. In first and ten, going for broke. I love it! All bull aside, go inside the NFL as the season nears its peak with hosts Len Dawson and Nick Bonacopi. America Undercover tackles the delicate issue of serious illness as five American families face the unthinkable in murder or mercy. I love it dearly, and that's the reason I've had to do it. In February, we're predicting a winter heat wave as On Location goes to Broadway with Jackie Mason. You're gonna laugh. <laughs> Maybe you won't, it's up to you. And nothing goes right as usual for Rodney Dangerfield. I mean, that's the story of my life. No respect. Don't get over. Look for these two super stand-ups as part of February's Super Saturdays. America Undercover asks, do the guilty go free? And HBO Pictures presents Leslie Ann Warren and Peter Coyote in Baja, Oklahoma. The New Year's forecast, an original winter heat wave. The place to be, HBO. If the question is about celebrities, the answer can be found on HBO Q&A. Don Amici won an Academy Award for his performance in Cocoon, which is airing in January on HBO. He's been one of Hollywood's most successful actors for over 50 years. What was his very first acting role? Well, that was at a little school in uh, Cedar Rapids, Iowa. And we had a uh, fire drill one morning, a little before 6 o'clock in the morning, I think it was. It was pitch dark out there at that time. This was in the winter. And I came down the fire escape, and it was cold, and I was running. And I came around the corner, and I ran into uh, the janitor, and he had a pipe in his mouth, and I think my right eye ran into the pipe, and I had a black eye. And at the time, uh, uh, we were rehearsing a play in which I was playing the Blessed Mother, so I had to go on playing the Blessed Mother with a black eye. Steve Martin, Chevy Chase, and Martin Short star in Three Amigos this month on HBO. They're three comedy powerhouses in their own right. How did they get along together on the set? Mm, he didn't ask that. Yeah. He didn't? Oh, he didn't no. ask that. I don't oh, yes. think that's what the question no, was. No, that's not the question. He was egg he said, what we are you doing now? He didn't want to know what No, doing no, he next. said, what would no. you like to do? A dream project. Yeah. Oh, Not what are you doing, Mr. Promotion. I, I answered the question for you. Yeah. Uh, I think you would agree with what Chevy said. Yeah, I can say. If I had understood any... <laughs> if it had a... If his Academy Award winner Shirley MacLaine stars in The Turning Point in January on HBO. As an author, she's had five books on the bestseller list. What first inspired her to become a writer? I think one of the reasons I began to write was because the long setups in between a scene were very boring to me. So I would sit down and pull out my pencil and sit down and jot down some thoughts. And pretty soon that became a chapter and then I would extend that and that would become a chapter and then they would call me to the set and I would think, that's interfering with what I'm doing in the dressing room, which is really interesting to me. And that's when I began to turn down movies and start to write more books. This is HBO Q&A. Season's greetings from all of us here at HBO. And may the warmth and sharing of the holidays stay with you throughout the new year. If you missed Robert Townsend and his partners in crime on the HBO Comedy Hour Live, you missed a real song and dance. You missed Robert tooting his horn and Robert's own dynasty. You missed Robert's rock vice and Robert's best friends. You missed the variety show at its best. Catch the return of Robert Townsend and his partners in crime on the HBO Comedy Hour Wednesday.
This New Year's, the party's at your house and the guests are on their way. We are guardian comedians. We'll be on your street. We know where you live. You supply the TV and we'll supply the last laughs. You'll get airline jokes, hairline jokes, and the all-time favorite, take my wife, please. And the most devastating joke of them all that we're now working on. That's the neutron joke. The joke that leaves the room standing but really kills the crowd. The chuckles begin with the hilarious highlights of Comic Relief 87. <laughs> then it's seven of the year's funniest on locations featuring some rather unusual comedians. I hate that word. I want to be called domestic goddess. It's so much more descriptive. Hi, pigs. They're a wild bunch. They have their own little celebration dance that they do either. <laughs> Such a special night. Yeah, let's party. New Year's Eve starting at 8. Just turn on your TV and it's a party. All night long, last laughs on HBO. Yeah. He's back. <laughs> In a spine-tingling adventure. Full of action and romance. Who are you? It's Indiana Jones. He's heroic, he's ruthless, and he's about to face his biggest challenge. Harrison Ford stars in Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Premieres Friday, January 1st on HBO. Superstars. Super Cinema. Super Specials. Super Saturdays on HBO. It's when you really feel the glow. Totally. So get ready. All right, I'm ready. Get set. Oh, yeah, I'm cooking now. Get all revved up. Go, because every Saturday night, HBO gives you what you like. The best. All right. With super action. That is incredible. Super excitement. What more could you possibly want? That's what you want, isn't it? There's no doubt about it. Let's party. On the next Super Saturday, he's in training to become a professional criminal. He told me that when I grew up, I could do whatever I wanted. And he thinks he's some kind of Robin Hood. I discovered a way to temporarily screw the system. But it's gone out of control. What do you mean, Johnny? Right. Emilio Estevez, Demi Moore, Wisdom. Then, watch Hysteria in the making as On Location brings you the 11th Annual Young Comedian Show. <laughs> Coming up on the next Super Saturday, January 2nd on HBO. The Bad, the Bawd, and the Beautiful, tonight on HBO. At 9, a hotshot kid and an Air Force pilot fly a rescue raid in the Middle East, Iron Eagle. At 11, the Divine Miss M caught live and in concert, Bette Midler, Divine Madness. At 12.35, a bizarre bequest gets the best of two bachelor brothers, Malibu Bikini Shop. The Daring, the Decadent, and the Divine, tonight on HBO. has been rated PG-13 by the Motion Picture Association of America. Some material may be inappropriate for young children. Parents may wish to consider whether it should be viewed by those under 13.